Hakuto's lunar exploration rover has been. Japan's space ambitions are lifting off. Its Aerospace Exploration Agency has agreed to work with iSpace Technologies to create a blueprint for a lunar resource mining industry in Japan. Water molecules become fuel. They can propel rockets into space. iSpace plans to find this water and build a system of lunar fuel stations on the moon. iSpace is a private lunar exploration company set up in 2013 by Takeshi Hakamada. On the moon, we have access to oxygen, which is the primary part of all fuels used in space. Space policy officials say that for more extensive exploration, mining space resources is necessary. The rover includes various commercial products for weight and cost reduction. Using its micro-robotic technology, iSpace plans to first map the moon's resources, looking for hydrogen that can be extracted and turned into fuel. Then eventually it wants to set up a lunar fuel production and delivery system that provides services to its partners around the world. This getting to the moon is really getting good. iSpace is also managing Japan's only entry for the Google Lunar X Prize where 16 teams are competing to land a probe on the moon, move it 500 meters, and then send HD photos and video back to Earth, all by the end of 2017. The first team to complete the mission gets $20 million. Japan's space industry still lags behind other countries, especially in resources. This year, Japan passed two laws clarifying rules for satellite launches and satellite images, though neither covers space resources. The latest agreement with JAXA is a giant leap for Japan's space ambitions, but there is still a long way to go before the moon provides fuel for space explorers.